The daughters of former Super Eagle striker Rashid Yakini are planning to make his house in Ibadan a museum to immortalize him. Yemsi and Omoyemi, who were guests on channels or TV sports program, said they want aspiring footballers who did not have the opportunity to see their father play to know more about him. Yemsi is also planning a documentary of his life and with most of his medals already missing, the children plan to use what they have been given by his Portuguese club Vitoria Setubal and the organizers of the legendary awards to start the project. Rashid Yekini died on May the 24th, 2012 at the age of 48. Um, firstly, I want to try and make a documentary after finishing him, a documentary about his life, his success, um, things that led up to his death. Um, I'm also thinking of doing a museum in his name, um, give the people, the football fans, the um, fo people who want to become up-and-coming footballers a chance to see the hard work and what it takes to become a footballer and the lengths you can go to. So that's how I want to do a museum. Um, I probably want to do it in his house because that's okay. something me and Yemi shared together with him. I just have medals that I collected from Portugal and a jersey. They also gave me a book of his whole life, but it's in Portuguese. I'm still trying to translate that. Okay. So, yeah, that's the things I want to start with. Legends who had died and who are still living, they are trying to, like, OK, bring their names, trying to imprint them on her. Normally, they will imprint their feet on gold platter. But since it was no more, they embedded its face on a gold platter and gave it to us. So that's a thing that I say, okay, I have of him.